Russia's TASS state media outlet has reported that the country's upcoming POC DA intercontinental range stealth bomber will place a strong emphasis on electronic warfare to provide a defense against enemy surface to air and air to air missile attacks. The report cited an unnamed source in Russia's military industrial complex, who stated, a completely new airborne defense system is being developed for POC-DA, which will protect it from all types of weapons, radar and optical. While Russia's NATO relatively limited ground-based anti-aircraft weapons systems, with the notable exception of Turkey which purchased S-400 long-ranged air defense systems from Russia itself, the US is currently developing multiple classes of long-range air-to-air missiles for its fighters one of which is specifically optimized for neutralizing large aircraft such as bombers and will be deployed by new F-15X fighters. The new bombers are expected to replace the 295 bombers in Russian service, and may also replace a portion of the 222M and 2160 fleets. According to TASS industry source, the new bomber will be built exclusively for standoff attacks and all not rely on gravity bombs. This will allow the aircraft not to enter the enemy's air defense zone, to hit designated targets from the world's oceans or from the territory of another state, he stated. The aircraft will carry intra-fuselage weapons to maintain a small radar cross-section, much like the Russian Okhotnik stealth drone and the upcoming American B-21 and Chinese H-20 bombers. The source further revealed that the first prototype of the new bomber is currently under construction. The bomber is scheduled to enter service in 2027. The US is currently producing the first prototype of the POC-DA rival, the B-21, while China's next-generation bomber program appears to be ahead of both and has reportedly already begun serial production. The new bomber is expected to make use of a flying wing design, and to rely on enhanced variants of existing air launch missile designs such as the KH-47M2 hypersonic and KH-101 radar evading missiles. It remains uncertain whether the POC-DA airframe will be suitable for tactical missions to replace the 222M bomber currently in service, and whether its airframe will be used to develop other military aircraft such as AEW or surveillance jets.